Well, up at Ramsey Grammar with me is head teacher Annette, also Cathy. We're in the lecture room, which uh, behind us has got a bit of opera playing, and, and that's really why we're here today, isn't it? To talk about screenings and, and the live events that other places have been doing, but it, they're here in Ramsey, and this is pretty well a fantastic place to have it. Cathy, this, you kind of look after day-to-day -day stuff, yeah? I do, yes. My job, I was recruited to help with the organisation of the uh, programme, which we started a year ago. In fact, this week is our first birthday. So uh, during that time, we've shown 23 different productions, ranging from comedy to drama to musicals to opera mm. and ballet. Um, just the whole gamut, really. So we're very lucky we get a nice wide variety, something for everybody. I just think when I was a kid, having a cinema in Ramsey, that's a long time ago. There isn't, there's not a lot of places in the north, is there? No, and this is the problem. We want to, we want to really create the northern powerhouse here at uh, Ramsey Grammar School and bring uh, lots, of, lots more activities and events and leisure facilities, really, to the area. I was looking at the census. I mean, what started this was when I came here as, as, uh, um, as head of the school, I, I, I was looking at the census and I thought, how come half the population of the island live in the north mm. and most of the facilities and the things to do are concentrated in Douglas mm. and the reason why that's important to us as a school is that school is not just about exam results and uh, what you do in the classroom it's about what the community does and how the community gets involved in the life of the school and what the school can bring to that community so uh, in conjunction with my um, very good friend Adrienne Burnett who had successfully started this live screening at, at uh, Balakameen High School uh, and with the help of the Arts Council, uh, we brought live screening to the north uh, just over a year ago. Uh, and we hope this is going to be the start of um, lots of different things that we can do to put this school right at the heart of the community here and, uh, uh, and provide a centre for the arts here. It's a great location as well, I love it. Fabulous, yeah. yeah. yeah um, the pictures don't do it justice really mm. because uh, it's actually a purpose-built lecture theatre um, with comfortable seating and benches, in fact. So um, my um, my good friend here, Kath, uh, does such wonderful refreshments. I was going to say, you have a green room, I hear. We do have a green room. Mm. Um, so, yes, part of the whole experience is that we provide refreshments during the intermissions and also beforehand. So it's very sociable. People come in and chat and have something to eat and drink. And then, of course, being a lecture theatre, it lends itself to them bringing in uh, bring them in with them and that's enjoying right. them. That's the way to do it. That's mm. definitely. Right. Now I know September kicks off the new season, so uh, the pamphlet you're holding on to that's oh, available yeah. where? Ta-da! Well, we have them here at school, but we're also going to make them available on the school website. Uh, and obviously, if anybody wants to join our email list, they can get in touch with us on the school telephone number or via our uh, Northern mm. Ex Theatre Experience Facebook page. The live streaming is. I mean, I've done it, and it is like just awesome to know that you are actually joining an audience in the West End or something. There's a big show in London, you've got that coming up, haven't you? We've got, we've been very lucky, we've been given permission to show uh, Everybody's Talking About Jamie, which is a huge hit at the West End, in the West End at the moment. It's just received, I think it's three Watts On Stage Awards, it was nominated for five Olivier Awards. It's the real, there's a real buzz about it, it's, it's kind of a feel-good show, a bit like Billy Elliot. Mm -hmm. Uh, and we can't, show, unfortunately, show it live, but we've been given permission to show it in September when the new season starts. Brilliant. So more information, pick up the, the leaflet. Absolutely. And I suppose it's, I say, this the thing about the school doesn't shut after the bell goes. Really. Absolutely. We, we just like as many people as possible to take the opportunity to experience this because we're here, we're happening, we're in the Northern Powerhouse and it's, it's all on now. So support us and get yourselves here.